Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad Wa ala alayhi wa sahbihi wa sallam Amma ba'da Habita fillah As we know and we all need to hear the reminder to make tawbah to Allah Azza wa Jal To strive our best because we have so many sins So many sins that we're aware of and those sins we're unaware of and those many sins we don't want anyone to be aware of. As the Prophet ﷺ mentioned, that sin, one of the signs of sin, is that you don't wish the people to know about what you have done. So that's one way you can tell it's sinful. If you're looking at something that you don't want anyone else to see that you're looking at. If you are listening to something that you don't want anyone else to know that you're listening to. Or if you touch or involve yourself in any activity that you don't want anyone else to know about, then those are signs that those activities are madhmoom, are sinful. And when we recognize that we sin, as the Prophet ﷺ said, كُلُّ إِبْنُ آدَمْ خَطَّ وَخَيْرٍ خَطَائِينَ أَتَوَابُونَ The Prophet ﷺ said, All the children of Adam make mistakes, and the best of those who make mistakes are those who repent. So we sin. أَسْتَغْفِرَ اللَّهُ وَأَتُوبُ إِلَيْكَ عن العزة ابن يسار المزني رضي الله تعالى عنه قال قال رسول الله صلى الله عليه وعلى آله وسلم يا أيها الناس توبوا إلى الله واستغفروه فإني أتوب في اليوم ما أتى مرة رواه مسلم من الحديث صحيح مسلم the hadith of Al-Ghara. So I made a mistake. It's not Al-Azza, but it is Al-Ghara. Al-Ghara ibn Yasar al-Mazani, radiyallahu ta'ala an, who said, I heard that the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam said, all mankind, so here the Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam addressed all mankind, not just the Mu'mineen. Ya you nas tubu illallah, make toba to Allah, repent to Allah. Wastaghfiruhu and seek forgiveness from Him. For verily I make toba in a day 100 times. This is the Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam who used to stand in the night prayer, who d had the, mes the message, the revelation revealed to him, the Qur'an revealed to him, who was a guidance for mankind, who used to stand in the night prayer, crying to his Lord, saying, shouldn't I be a thankful servant? He, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, used to make toba over a hundred times a day. And in this hadith, the Prophet, alayhi salatu wasalam, said toba. He didn't say istaghfar. We say istaghfar, we seek forgiveness from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala regularly. But here the Messenger of Allah alayhi salatu wasalam said a tawbah, meaning actual repentance, with the determination to remove oneself from sin and the sinful environment, with the intention to come back to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and not return back to the sin. The Messenger of Allah alayhi salatu wasalam did this over a hundred times a day, so how many times a day do you do it? And how many times of the day do you need to do it? So this is a good reminder for us that the Bab of Toba is open for us. It's not closed. We have an opportunity to come back to Allah Azza wa Jal. And that's a reminder for myself, most importantly. And then those listening, my brothers and sisters, because we need Toba. We need to come back to Allah Azza wa Jal. And Abi Musa al-Ash'ari radiyallahu ta'ala an 
عن النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم قال إن الله تعالى يبسط يده بالليل ليتوب مسي النهار ويبسط يده بالنهار ليتوب مسي الليل حتى تطلع الشمس من مغربها رواه مسلم إن سديث صحيح مسلم The Messenger of Allah sallallahu the hadith of uh, Abi Musa al-Ash'ari radiyallahu ta'ala he said that the Messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said that verily Allah the Almighty extends his hand during the, during the night to give forgiveness to those who committed sin during the during the day and he extends his hand during the day to receive the repentance of those who sin during the night and this happens until the sun sets in the west or the sun rises in the west. So this hadith of the Messenger of Allah وسلم, shows us that Toba, the Baba Toba is open for us. And that we have a chance, every one of us, because we know our sins, we know a lot of the stuff we're doing. And we seek forgiveness in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala from those things we do unknowingly. اللهم إني أعوذ بك أن أشرك بك وأنا أعلم واستغفرك لي من العلم. And we're in need of forgiveness from Allah Subhanahu wa Taala, and that gives us hope. That's a message of hope, and it's coming from the Sunnah of the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam. And this distinguishes us between, for example, the Catholics who repent to their priest, "Oh Father, I have forgiven," and the, or the or, or the Christians that go in front of the church, "Oh preacher or congregation." I have forgiven. They ask forgiveness from human beings who had nothing to do with their sin, who didn't even know, need to know their sin. But Allah knew their sin. All they had to do was go back to Allah So Allah has made it easy for the believer. The believer knows the path. Is, the path of Toba is easy. It's with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And this path is open for us. So come back to Allah Strive your best to know your Lord and come back to Him and worship Him and Him alone. Do those things that He is pleased with and avoid those things He is displeased with. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.